this was a victorious night for John McCain. Addressing cheering crowds, he said he was confident he would win the Republican nomination and run for president in November. We won primaries in the West, the South, the Midwest, and the Northeast. And although I've never minded the role of the underdog and have relished as much as anyone come from behind wins, tonight, I think we must get used to the idea that we are the Republican Party frontrunner for the nomination of President of the United States. Mr. McCain swept the board of big Super Tuesday states to the delight of his supporters. Most at his celebration rally in Phoenix, Arizona, expressed joy that their man had all but secured the Republican nomination. I think it's great. I expect to see him in the White House in January. I'm very excited. He's the right man for this time in our uh, country's, um, pre you know, predicament. The economy, uh, the war, the terrorism. He's the right person. I think it feels great. It's, uh, he's, he's our home state guy, and we like him here. Makes me feel very good. Been a backer of John's for a long time and a good friend of the Sanders. But it was a different mood at Mitt Romney headquarters in Boston. Mr. Romney only managed to score wins in a few smaller states, losing out to Mike Huckabee in a number of southern primaries. Mr. Romney played down the significance of his Super Tuesday performance. I think there's some people who, who thought it was all going to be done tonight. But it's not all done tonight. We're going to keep on battling. We're going to go all the way to the convention. We're going to win this thing, and we're going to get to the White House. But it was John McCain who had reason for celebration, and his win in big Super Tuesday states will make his lead almost unassailable. This was a confident speech from Senator McCain. Shortly after it was announced that he'd won his home state of Arizona, the senator appeared here in Phoenix in front of hundreds of cheering supporters and said he was ready to become the next president of the United States. Steve Mort, SABC, Phoenix.